I've seen that. A lot of people believe that out outer towners are being targeted in in like in a way that's like extra. Like like as if people from LA aren't targets themselves. Bro, that's what I'm telling you, what y'all don't realize that the LA pickings are kind of slim because the temperature and the climate is set. Locals know where to be with and without valuables. So it's kind of hard for us to keep, not us, but those out here to keep getting those out here because people out here know what and what not to do. The only people who seemingly don't get it or don't want to get it, accept it or acknowledge it seems to be out of towners. So it's just like Cat Williams when he made the joke about the lions in the um, cage. And one day a month human fall in. It's like everybody is hiding everything and niggas out here that's willing to take thirsty it's like, look at this mother. Wow. A, somebody still don't get it. They thought everybody got the memo when the game is over. So when you can imagine those with the energy, the willingness, and the interest to get down like that, see it come right across their face, they can't believe it. I, I promise you, on my mama, mama, my daughter's dead, homies, lokes, loved ones, everything I love and live for, I done seen Petey Pablo in a car getting his earrings unscrewed. And by the grace of God, he was with Suge, and that didn't stop the process because, yeah, I hate to make it. It's, the whole get down was, even though you were Suge, you didn't know, we out here 50 deep. Suge is going to make sure it looks like he's the first person in the entourage. You number 50, and he don't have no idea what's going on down here, even though that's, that's what we was, that's what's up, right? So just imagine I'm watching Petey Pablo in his car, and... and Fuck it. My brother, Big Spider, in his passenger seat doing this. And Petey Pablo letting him unscrew his earrings. Rest in peace, Del Dog from Main Street. If it wasn't for Del Dog pulling up, not demanding, but really politicking, pleading, begging my brother, because he had interest with Petey Pablo that he needed Petey Pablo to feel like, I'm safe with you. I was here with you. So Del Dog like, really like, pleaded to my brother to give him that pass which was a very hard pass for my brother to get. But I just seen Petey Pablo sit there and allow a nigga to screw his earrings out and didn't do nothing. Damn. Am I lying, Petey Pablo? Man, Suge just pretended like he wasn't around or didn't. Because wasn't Petey Pablo actually signed to death row at one point or was going to sign? This is the thing. With Suge, it had nothing to do with Petey Pablo. It had everything to do with when he got to fucking with us, my brother, M.O., his whole interest, his approach was to ask Suge permission. Is it okay for me to get out like that around here while we're moving around? And just before it was a, even a Petey Pablo to think about, and my brother getting that Suge like that, when nobody in particular was the person we're talking about, Suge kind of like gave him the green light and let him know, I know how you get out, and when we're moving, that's in the game too. You know, just don't be messy, cross nobody up, implicate nothing. He Suge ain't robbing nobody. He ain't got nothing to do with it. But he was trying to let my brother know, I know how you get down. And when shit go down, if it go down, don't feel like I think you offending me or, you know, back doing. Like, green light. You know, just keep it clean as far as don't have me crossed up. That was just the understanding. And Petey Pablo, just somebody else, that another nigga. So that was just the understanding. Suge wasn't going to let Petey Pablo feel like, oh, you watch me get robbed. Nah. Suge still gonna have a position with Petey Pablo like I'm at least trying to see what I could do. And Suge was cool enough to where he might negotiate a few coins up out of Petey Pablo on our behalf for him to get them earrings back. It was that type of understanding. You feel me? So I'm just letting you know it's nothing new for that type of shit to be going down. Like Petey Pablo, yeah. He was sitting there real comfortable, calm, letting the nigga unscrew his earrings. 